Good morning, guys. I'll get to the point right away. I'm retiring for good. I know the process uh, was a pretty big deal last time, so when I woke up this morning, I figured I'd just press record and let you guys know first, so I uh, won't be long-winded. You only get one super emotional retirement essay, and I used mine up last year, so I uh, really thank you guys so much to every single one of you for supporting me, my family, my friends, my teammates, my competitors, I could go on forever. There's too many. Um, thank you guys for allowing me to live my absolute dream. I wouldn't change a thing. Love you all. Tom Brady should probably be the number one overall player. You can never count Tom Brady out. 45, 46 years old. That dude is a, he's a monster, man. Tom. Tom, that was all first. He was the number one player in the NFL. TB, bro. In the league. Tom Brady. I gotta go with Tom Brady, man. He got he he 80 years old throwing for 5,000 yards, man. I gotta go with Tom Brady. He's not the biggest. He was never the strongest. He was never the fastest. He was overlooked. He went in the sixth round. So with that being said, every all of the intangibles that a quarterback's supposed to have, they overlooked with him because it was burning from the inside of him. Greatness. It's like, well, how how good are you? What are your stats? You know, I, what do you look like on the on the film? And then there's the people who always want to validate it by wins and championships. Well, he's got both. <laughs> and there, I don't I don't think how you can argue or who you can compare him to to say that he's not the best of all time.